We are here with uh, world-class violinist Mary Simpson, and she's amazing. You, for those of you who have seen her on stage, the performance is phenomenal. She plays everything from beautiful, soft passages all the way to just rock and roll, and uh, just sounds like an electric guitar sometimes. She's powerful, a lot of power, a lot of speed, a lot of everything. This is just a, a phenomenal instrument to work with. And uh, she was not ready for this. I surprised her because uh, we are just, I'm not even dressed either. <laughs> we just uh, um, finished uh, sound check and we're getting ready to do a concert tonight. And I just grabbed her right off the corridor outside and said, come on in, let's do this. It's much better like this. Anyway, this is Mary Simpson. Uh, yeah, I like it. <laughs> she, can you play something like, let's start with uh, something beautiful, like Felita. Yeah, of course. I love that tune. First of all, how do you get your, your tune source? How do you get your, your intonation? Well, what when, I, when I warm up, um, see, this, this piece, it's all on one string. Yeah. So when I warm up, I kind of do a drone with the D, and that really helps me set my intonation. <laughs> Now play it without the drone, because mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's, there you go, sweet. Uh, what happens with this piece that makes it very difficult to keep the intonation correct is that she plays everything on one string. Yeah, it's all on the G. <laughs> yes, and that makes it extremely difficult. If you change strings, it's easier to play, but it doesn't sound as good. It doesn't have that depth and that richness. Exactly, yeah. and you do feel proud. She does that every night, and uh, I, I know how difficult it is to do this. When people say, it sounds like a viola or a cello, almost mm -hmm. it gets so fast, and it's a violin. Mm -hmm. That's why we don't change strings. Yeah. Anyway, she also has, uh, she's from Virginia, first of all, so she has a natural, she can just tear into the violin. <laughs> so she's got a lot of power and very strong arms, she's got really good muscles. So she can do things that most women are not strong enough to do. It's very important that you understand that. Um, it's, uh, she can play the storm, which is extremely difficult to play, particularly for a woman, because a man is a little stronger naturally, but I have not met a lot of women that can actually play the storm, which you know about. Play a couple of the riffs on Renegade. I don't know if you can play it. You're, uh, she's not warmed up anyway, so that's okay. <laughs> That was easy, wasn't it? I can do sure. that, no yeah. problem. <laughs> and then, you know what's really interesting? She was telling me yesterday about, we, she, she, she's not afraid to look, um, a visual contact, she's not afraid to look in my eyes. She just, we look at each other yeah. and... It's, it's great. Um, eye contact really helps me play, actually, because I get a lot of energy from it. Mm -hmm. And so it's like, music, music is dynamic. Music, mm -hmm. performance especially, it's like you need you need a back and forth yeah. and so it's like you do that with the audience we do it with the musicians um and you're you're great with it it's like you know if you if you're on stage and you know you need a little bit of a pick me up just look right at you and it's like perfect right there she does and, and i do give them give them all energy that's yeah. why sometimes i apologize mm -hmm. i turn my back to the audience most of the, a lot of the time because i'm just trying to, I'm enjoying her performance. I'm enjoying <laughs> the, the cello. I'm enjoying the violin, Sambo, uh, Sasha, and then I have Jaycar playing the trumpet. I tend to look at everybody because the, the eye contact, like Mary s said, uh, for performing uh, is uh, very, very important. It gives you this extra energy. Mm -hmm. Plus, it's a lot of fun when you're sharing <laughs> the fun. Yeah, know? because I mean, we, I have a great time <laughs> up on stage. Yeah, we do. <laughs> it's awesome. It's awesome. What else do you want to show them? Um, how about a little bit of uh, Rain Must Fall? Okay. Oh so. yeah, this is like Jimi Hendrix's uh, guitar. I mean, this is like... A... 
Except we I don't have echo here, it's the real thing. Mm -hmm. I like the, uh, that, that part where I go. So there you go. This is the real thing. See, it's it's not so easy what she does, and we don't get it all the time. It's not like when I play the piano, I hit an A note. It's an A note. As long as I hit the, the right note, it's gonna sound like an A. There is no frets here. If you don't move your finger one sixty fourth of an inch this way or that way, you're out. It's yeah. the, it's the wrong note. You're sounding bad. Um, so you can see how difficult it is. She has to be warmed up. She has to be all together, you know, and then obviously the audience and the energy. Yeah. But this is um, a good uh, idea and uh, looking inside about performance and what she has to go through, Mary has to go through to put out this great energy that she does. And she gets the audience every night. Everybody goes crazy. Thank you. It's a lot of fun. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> She does. <laughs> okay. Goodbye. Bye.